I don't know what that means. This is the only business I know that's real. I'm stuck. What do you mean, stuck? I don't know. It just seems like I've been working my whole life, you know, to try to get a chance to do something, and I don't know if I'm going to ever get a chance to do it. Ah, uh, you... Hey. No, no, I told you. No, 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 you know, if you don't start paying more attention to the way your trapezius goes up into your deltoids, you're going to throw off your entire cervical and your lumbar area. Huh? Since I'm the only guy who knows how to fix that thing for you, you ought to start listening to me. Maybe you ought to trade places, eh? You be the trainer and I'll start on Sunday. Yeah. Well, I'm starting against Dallas? Yeah. They don't want to go with Jared. They want to go with you. Happy birthday, Joe. Hey, my watch stopped. Look at that. It keeps flashing the same time. <laughs> I'm dreaming, huh? <laughs> uh, I... Hey. This is an airplane dream. I forget what they're supposed to mean. I think they're a good sign, aren't they? Mr. Pendleton. Mr. Pendleton, you must wait for me. I'm your escort. Wait for me, please, Mr. Pendleton. The end of the line, Mr. Pendleton, please. Hi, how you doing? Hey, uh, you want to hear a little music? <clears throat> you have to wait in line, Mr. Pendleton. What? This is my dream, isn't it? You mustn't get out of line, really. Chamberlain, Paul R. All right, I think I've brought the uh, I've escorted the final passenger. This manifest is complete. Hi, Hi, Mr. Pendleton, you cannot board before your turn. Yeah, well, I don't need a turn, because I'm not going to get on that thing. No, I don't think you understand. This is not your ultimate destination. This is a way station. That will take you to your ultimate Abraham. destination. Yeah, well, I'm not going to my ultimate yeah. destination, so I'm just going to do a little run around here until I wake up. Mr. Pendleton, I'm afraid I haven't fully explained the uh, basis on which this system is organized. The rules of this way station derive from your own. They are a product of your image and the image of those who share your image. And if you violate the rules, if you question the unifying principles, you hey, violate... you want to see a trick? Let me show you this. I just do this once in a while to keep my abductor pollicus limber so I don't have a lot of patter with it, but it, it's called a thumb palm. You want to feel that? That's perfectly solid 50 cent piece. What I do is I just... 
throw that into that hand, you see, and I say the magic words, abracadabra, abracadabra, and then presto, it's gone. Now, you probably think I still have it, don't you? <laughs> You're wrong, because I can see it coming right out of your ear, right there, see that? That's the only trick I know. <laughs> Mr. Pendleton! Gentlemen, gentlemen, what's the delay? Sir, we've received a new arrival who refuses to board. But that's impossible. Have you explained the rules to him? Yes, sir. Quite clearly? Yes, sir. And what was his rebuttal? He took a coin out of my ear. Did he? Perhaps I should have a word with him. Yes, sir. Mr. Pendleton! He's right over there, sir. Mr. Pendleton? Yeah. Hey, you can call me Joe. How you doing? Mr. Pendleton, you know where you are, don't you? Yeah, I'm in the middle of a really weird dream. You see the problem? Joe, come here. <laughs>